Hi, I'm going to show you how to insert audio files in a Google Slides presentation. I'm going to show you how to use an app to record it and how to put it in your Google Drive and how to get it from your Google Drive into your Google Slides. Okay, first I'm going to go get the app that I need to record my voice. I'm going to do that on the App Store, but if you have an Android phone, you need to do that on the Play Store. I'm going to search for Voice Record Pro. This is the one I want right here, Voice Record Pro. Its icon is this sort of red and black background with headphones and a microphone. Okay, so now I have my app, Voice Record Pro. This is what it looks like. I'm going to open it. I'm going to give it access to my microphone. And I need to connect it to my Google Drive. I'm going to do that up here where it looks like a cloud. I'm going to choose Google Drive. And I'm going to look at export with Google Drive. That means I'm going to send files from this app to my Google Drive. I'm going to choose the right Gmail to add it to. Now you can see my SQU Gmail is signed in. So I can go back and close that. I can make recordings. And to do that, I'm going to click record. It's, I don't need notifications. Here I can choose how it's going to record. To put things in your Google Slides, it needs to be in MP3 form. So we're going to choose that. I'm going to leave it at medium quality. You can choose low if you have a bad connection or high if you have a good connection. This is just the quality of the recording. Low is okay. I'm going to choose advanced and I'm going to choose MP3. MP3 is what I want. When I'm ready to start recording, I'm going to click start up here. Now I'm going to record my audio. This is my speaking assignment and I'm going to tell you all about blah, 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 blah. When I'm finished, I click stop. It takes just a second to process the file. I am going to change the name of my file so I can find it easily with the little pencil. I'm going to say speaking assignment week five. I'm going to change the file name as well. That means when I see it in the app and in my drive, it will be the same. And I'm going to click accept changes. So now I can see it's an MP3. It's got a name and I'm going to say save to Google Drive. Now I have to upload. Okay, it's there. I can go to my Google Drive and I can search for it. Speaking assignment week five MP3. That's exactly what I want. I can click the three buttons, click share. I'm going to click who has access and I am going to change to make it so that anyone at SQU can view it. That means they can listen to it. Now I want to get that link. So I'm going to click these again. Link sharing is on now and I'm going to click copy link. Now when I open my Google slide, I can see there are some slides here. I'm going to make my own new slide. Let's choose this one. I'm going to type my name. Jennifer week five. Here I'm going to type my text. This is my speaking. Now, 
If I'm on a computer, it's different. I can insert it a little bit different way, but like this, we're just going to have to insert it with a link. So I am going to select the text here and I am going to add a link. The link is the link that I got from my audio. So I'm going to click the plus button, choose link, and I am going to paste the link from my listening and click the check. So now I have a link to my speaking. So when someone is looking at it, they can follow the link. So when I'm presenting, it looks like this. I can click the link and it will open in a new window. Okay, so it's open in a new window now. I can hit play to listen. Now I'm going to record my audio. This is my speaking assignment and I'm going to tell you all about. So now I have my audio embedded in the slide and my classmates can listen to it.